Four by four time here at Unique, especially in classics. 1987 Chevrolet K10 Custom Deluxe, regular cab, short box. As you can see, truck as far as finish on it, patinaed. Definitely has that aged paint look. I want to go through a few other things on this I want to let you know about. It's kind of one of those, you know, if you want to drive it the way it is with a patina look or take it to the next level and put some TLC, a little elbow grease and some time into it, could sure do that. These trucks and this body style especially, let alone the regular cab short box, becoming very, very popular. Let's go ahead and take a look at the chrome on the front of this. Won't have to do a whole lot with the chrome bumper on it. Obviously losing some of the clear on the hood, but again, that's kind of where that patina looks coming from. Now, if you want to check out the still pictures, so you can kind of snoop through those to kind of see what I'm talking about. Still pictures can be seen at uniqueclassiccars.com. Click on the link down below this video in the description. It's going to take you right there. You can always call us too, 507-386-1726. 4.3 liter underneath the hood. Three-speed manual transmission with a granny gear. Power steering, power brakes, AC, so nicely equipped truck. I have not had the AC compressor kicking on, by the way. Uh, blue on blue with a darker blue vinyl interior. Interior looks pretty original. Now remember, we do consider trades. Financing is available. Of course, we can assist with the transportation, and this vehicle may be eligible for an extended service contract. Consult with your sales associate when you call in or email. Now, some of the things you're going to want to take a look at are the underside picks of this. Of course, the cab corners would need to be replaced, as you can see there. Some of the lower rockers is where you'd have to get into some of the body work if you wanted, again, to take this to the next level. And take a good look at the underside picks. Going to need some care underneath there, too, again, if you wanted to make it into a show truck. you got a starter regular cab short box. And again, that's half the battle. I do have a picture of the RPO codes that are in the dash of this also are in the glove box. So you can see those in the still pictures. Once again, those still pictures, uniqueclassiccars.com. Click on the link down below this video in the description. It's going to take you right there. Rear side of the bed, the usual suspect spots. You have to have some sheet metal added in or new bedside. Again, lower rockers cap corners so we're just going to take some attention all right snoop at the interior no carpeting this one so at least you get a good good shot of the floor yeah you got some surface rust there but no holes as far as in the floors doors did not look bad i have pictures of the uh, undersides of the doors in with the stills so you can get a look at those too let's go ahead and start it up so you can hear it run yeah 4.3 with a manual in it. So I take that back. You have basically a four speed, I should say. I said three speed with a granny gear before. So ultimately a four speed. Uh, some people consider a three speed with a granny gear because you won't use that bow a whole lot. That is just for towing and is geared extremely low. Alright, make sure we're neutral there. On the other side of the floor. Look at the dash. I did have the uh, wipers working, horn worked. The blower fan does work. Uh, it was just the fact that the compressor wouldn't kick on and off. And if here's the gas gauge, because the gauges here are in working order, assuming the temp gauge is gonna go up with the temperature of the engine, but voltage and oil pressure all good. All right, let's slip around to the back of this. Here, run. This is a smooth runner, sounds good. And engine bay look nice and tidy too. We'll check it out here, that out here in just a second. All right. I'm gonna pause this a second while I get this hood popped and check out the engine bay. Hey, did you know that this car qualifies for an extended warranty? It's just like the one you get at your new car dealership, except it covers your classic car instead. It covers all the major components like engine, transmission, drivetrain, and you can get coverage up to 10 years. Repairs aren't cheap. These extended warranties are a no-brainer. Contact us for a quote on this car today. There we go, hood popped. You can see the AC compressor. Here's all the components are there. Of course, I mentioned 4.3 liter. 
Obviously, these would have been a throttle body. Power steering, power brakes. Get an idea. Pretty stock looking engine bay there. Smooth running. 4.3. So like I said, you're looking for one to drive with some patina to it, or you want a starter for the next project, here you go, 1987 Chevrolet K10 Custom Deluxe. Regular cab, short box. Give us a call, 507-386-1726, uniqueclassiccars.com. Click on the link down below this video in the description. It's going to take you right there. And remember, we do consider trades. Financing is available. Of course, we can assist with transportation in this vehicle mainly. Be eligible for an extended service contract. Double check with your sales associate when you come.